Hi everyone, it's Tuesday and it's time for another great story. Our class loved the three bears so much that I found another story that I think you'll like. This is called The Three Bears ABC, an alphabet book by Grace Macron, illustrated by Holly Hibbert. Here we go kids, you're gonna love it. A is for alphabet and here it is. B is for bears. There were three bears, mama bear, papa bear, and baby bear who were in bed. Then mama bear made breakfast with big bowls of porridge. Letter C. C is for cool. The bears waited for the hot porridge to cool. So papa bear put on his cap and mama bear her cape and baby bear his coat. Letter D. D is for door. They headed for the door. And E is for exit. Everyone exited. Letter F is for forest. While their porridge cooled, the bears walked in the forest where they sniffed a fragrant flowers. G is for girl named Goldilocks. H is for house. Goldilocks saw the bear's happy house in the forest. I is for inside where Goldilocks went. J is for just right. The little bowl of porridge was just right. The big bowl of porridge was too hot. And the medium bowl of porridge was too cold. K is for kitchen. The bears kept their rocking chairs in the kitchen where Goldilocks tried each one. One was too fast, one was too slow, and one was just right. Oops, it broke. L is for little. Goldilocks lay on the three beds. The big bed was too hard. The medium bed was too soft. But Goldilocks liked the little bed so much that she fell asleep in it. M is for Mama. Mama led her family back home. N. N is for now. The bears were hungry. Grrr. They need their breakfast now. O. O is for open. The bears found their front door open. How odd. P. P is for Papa. Papa Bear pointed to his bowl and said, Someone has tasted my porridge. Someone has tasted my porridge too, said Mama Bear. And someone has tasted Baby Bear's porridge and eaten it all up. Q is for question. Baby Bear's Baby Bear asked this question. Who ate my porridge? Do you remember who did it? R is for rockers. The bears went to their rockers to rest, but someone had been sitting in them and Baby Bear's was broken. So they went to the bedroom. S is for sleeping. Someone has been sleeping in my bed, said Papa. Someone's been sleeping in my bed, said Mama. Someone's been sleeping in my bed, said Baby. T is for ta-da. Ta-da, said Baby Bear. There she is. And Goldilocks was so startled, she tumbled out of the bed. You. You is for up. Goldilocks jumped up. V is for very. Goldilocks was very, 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 very frightened. W is for window. Goldilocks jumped out the window. X marks the exact spot where she landed.
Y is for yellow. Yellow curls bobbed up and down as Goldilocks bounced back. Yikes, yelled Goldilocks. Z is for zipped. Goldilocks zipped back home as fast as her legs could carry her. And Z is for zany because it was that kind of day. Zany means it was a little crazy. I hope you enjoyed the story. If you heard extra noises coming from my house, that's Burke and Vaughn upstairs. They must have forgot I was filming. <laughs> oh, well. See you next time. Bye, everyone. Miss you.